Hi, welcome back to the channel. My name is Anastasia and I'm your go-to holistic health and fitness expert. If you haven't yet subscribed to this channel, do not miss out. Subscribe right now and stay updated with all tips and corrections that I add on a daily basis to this channel for you to be the healthiest and the best version of yourself. In today's video, I want to share with you how to boost your immune system naturally, how to improve your immune system naturally. Hence, what does it mean? It means the quality of your health, because when our immune system is weak, because we do not take proper care, we get inflammation, we get running nose, we get seasonal bacteria, we getting flu and tessera et cetera. It's all because immune system is weak. There is certain ways that I'm going to share right now with you where you can help yourself with a very small inv investment of your time and little of financial. You do not need to go and rely your immune system on any sort of supplements or powder, which I do not recommend. You need to rely on yourself because your health is in your hand. And here I'm sharing with you how to do it. First of all is quality of your sleep. When your body getting enough of sleep, hence we can say for adult men or women, it's seven to eight hours. It would be proper sleeping quota on a daily basis. So means every day you get seven to eight hours sleep. Of course, preferably when you go to bed at the same time and you wake up at the same time, you do not wake up at night. There's a lot of people, they think when they go to bed at 10 and they wake up at 7 that they get enough of quota, but they do not rest enough because they still feel tired. When you wake up at night, when you go even to the toilet at night, when you keep playing on your phone, replying to the emails, it's not a quarter of your sleeping. You reduce the quarter of your sleeping and you triggering your nervous system and still you do not get enough of sleeping. So you need to get yourself a ritual and kind of hygiene around your sleeping quarter. When you go to bed, you go to your bedroom, let's say you go 10 p.m., 11 p.m., whatever is your schedule, what is suitable for your lifestyle, specifically right now, you go, you do not play with your gadgets, with your phones, one hour, at least one hour in advance. You read the book, you do some paperwork, uh, you paint, you meditate, you pray, you do yoga, you stretch your back, you sit with your family, you sit with your kids, you uh, play with your pet, like some kind of this calming activities where we exchange energy in a calm way and hence your body understands that there is a time to relax and calm and then when you go to bed you rest and you have a deep sleep for the next six seven eight hours what is your quota and you do not have disturbance of waking up seeing a phone etc you have a proper sleeping and when you wake up the same thing if you wake up with the alarm okay that's understandable if you wake up without alarm still uh, you woke up you do your rituals morning rituals wc uh, shower breakfast do not touch your phone at least for 30 minutes of course the risk would be beneficial for one hour but at least 30 minutes try with as little as 15 minutes try it you will see the benefits that you will be in the face that you rule your life because when you get yourself into the form immediately you are in reacting mode you react to the social media that happening there you react to the messages that you got you react to the emails that you got and you already program yourself your mood for the day but when you take this 10-15 minutes for yourself for even you can call this spirituality, gratitude, observation, uh, solitude, time, call it whatever you want. But this makes sense. When you take time, this 10-15 minutes in the morning for yourself, you reflect, you choose your mood for the day. Also, again, you are in a calm system. You do not trigger your brain and your nervous system. And the quality of your life would improve and quality of your immune system would improve tremendously because you would be well-rested human being. Number two is your nutrition. Specifically nutrition when you eat a lot of raw food items. Fruits and vegetables, of course, is the best. For example, now we are in an autumn season. There's a lot of benefits to eat. A lot of pumpkin, pear, apple, citrus, like lemon, mandarin, grapefruit, pomelo. 
it's all great source for you to get vitamin C. Again, I'm not trying to remind you that there is a greatest even source of vitamin C is celery. Include one glass of celery juice or celery smoothie on an empty stomach condition in the morning and you will see the improvement of your health, of your immune system and all as a factors. I have another video, you can watch it out, check it out and start this transformation. So when we implement and basically not only implement to boost immune system, but when you reconsider your eating habits, your nutrition, when you understand the kind of like, not enlightenment, but understanding that what you give to yourself as a food you need to take through the filter that you nourish yourself. You do not just put something to not feel hungry, like either it's just bread, burger, cheese, uh, something getting a little rotten, something you overcook. You need to understand that you nourish and your body needs to get the certain amount of nutrients, certain amount of micro elements. And for you, it's kind of puzzle if you do not understand at the beginning, but it's very simple to understand when you put a time and um, Mm, ability to understand in this topic and you look in your kitchen and you look in a menu in a restaurant and you look at your grocery list and then your brain start to focus in a different direction like oh what did I need to eat in order to nourish myself to be healthy to have a strong immune system there's an autumn I do not want to be sick I want to be healthy I do not want to lose my time by like being in a bed and have running nose and invest some finance in the supplements and medical treatments and seeing doctor and again time value does not beneficial for you at all but when you invest on every single day basis you save your time you save your finances and you improve your health you improve the way you look when you eat matter when you have a uh, clean eating habits and it would benefit on all levels on your optimal health on your immune system on your digestion on the looks on your beauty on everything then number three is uh, superfoods especially autumn spring winter basically preferably most of the time you add to your food to your drinks ginger and garlic and pepper the red pepper it helps your system to prevent again any sort of disease. Also, in some point, I would add also honey, especially when there is autumn and winter. So, for example, even mixture of these superfoods, it's a great source for your immune system to improve. So, for example, great source for the autumn and winter to mix 50% in a jar of shredded be particular about this point shredded garlic and 50 percent of honey you mix them together and you have on uh, uh, before your food one teaspoon it will do a magic magic for your health even if you have a cough if you have running nose it would disappear without any single tablet and even do not wait till you coughing if you will have it on a daily basis you will see health improvement ginger you can add ginger to your soup pumpkin soup carrot soup uh, curry soup main dishes fish meat potatoes and you add even in your deserts like a ginger cookies you can make a brownie with the ginger for this extra spices for example me i like also to put ginger in my coffee which is also great taste of this spiciness or the red pepper powder it's also great source for this spicy and ginger you can also shred it and make it as a tea drink as a hot water again do not overdo because um, it's um, triggers the um, your kidney because you will go more often to WC to urinate so you need to understand also here what is your current health situation so you do not overdo but kind of superfoods like uh, ginger garlic honey pepper it helps your system to stay strong and to stay unshakable so this kind of habits like sleeping enough get on the watch of your nutrition and eating habits and consume superfoods such as ginger garlic uh, red pepper and honey and you will boost your system naturally it will help you when you put these all puzzles together maybe you wouldn't see that there is much of difference because it's basically very simple tips right but when you put 
and effort in these habits, in these tips on a daily basis, on a regular basis, when you really put yourself and you give yourself a proper sleep, when you deal with your stress and you prevent any kind of stress and anxiety so you do not have insomnia issues, you have proper eating habits, all factors when you, your eating habits, it stabilizes. Your immune system is boosting because your immune system, 80% of it is in your digestion system. So hence, what you eat, it's equal to your immune system. So it's very important to understand that you need to nourish your body, not just to put something to not feel hungry or just to skip dinner or skip lunch because you do not have time. Because remember, if you do not have time today, you do not have time tomorrow, if you will be busy over the weekend, your health would take over with the illness. And you know how it goes. It goes for a week or two. Sometimes, again, different body reacts different, especially what kind of disease you are catching. You will be just in a bed. You will be with a lot of medication, a lot of tea, a lot of drug materials, and you will not be able to work, to see your family, to have the quality of your life, to have a quality time. So think twice before you skipping the meal, before you are lazy to cook or nourish yourself well and going for junk food and do not neglect superfoods in your regular basis. Again, ginger is a great source to put even in your smoothies, in your drinks, uh, in your coffee. As I share with you my tip, I like to put ginger and uh, red pepper. It's an amazing spice taste and you will benefit on all levels. I hope this was insightful. I hope you will take into consideration your immune system, get these tips into implementation of your life. Do not wait till tomorrow for next week. Just start implement and you will see your immune system would be unshakable. That would result in optimal health, longevity and anti-aging. If you feel that you struggle with the area of your health, with nutrition, with eating habits, with procrastination about working out and exercising, I have a great offer. I have free consultation calls that I offer. I share about it almost on every video that you can book free consultation call with me where I will investigate, where I will study what is your current habits, what is your lifestyle, what is your eating habits, how you like to eat, what you do not like to eat. Maybe you have a um, extra weight or you're not happy with your body shape or maybe you do not like exercise maybe you feel always tired maybe you go through the uh, post part room or you go through the menopause there is always a way to heal through holistic way of living we can study and i will offer you my solution my guiding and you can choose to go with it with the health transformations that I offer. So this is it for this video. Do not forget to put like. If you like the video, share with someone who need to know how to save themselves and to not have a running nose this autumn and stay healthy. See you in the next video.